So we're going to have to talk about the performance of the trust. Oh, do we have to? We do, sorry. <laughs> you know, it, it is mortifying for me and my colleagues, you know, who work with me on this. So I, it's not the outcome that we have been working toward. And this is completely down to me. In hindsight, in 2020, we didn't have enough. We had something in UK listed technology and software companies, but in hindsight, not enough. But in a sense, AI is just a continuation of essentially the digitization of the world that's been happening for the last 20 years and that we've been alert to for much longer than just the last couple of years. I mean, I might say to myself, why didn't I own right move 10 years ago? I rather wish that I had. But is it too late to initiate a holding and build a big position right move? I, I sincerely sincerely hope not. I can't offer anything more, I don't think, than blood, sweat and tears. I just think that it's so obvious why the London stock market has struggled. Life should be an adventure. I mean, it really should be an adventure. And picking individual companies, backing individual companies, feeling part of that entrepreneurial wealth creation, that's critical for progress and wealth creation. And it feels a lot better than just saying, oh, I'm going to invest on a pari pursuit basis in every company. I don't care how good or bad it. Do you know what I mean? I, it's just, it's more an, of an adventure. And, and within reason for people's personal finances, I would say, take an adventure. <laughs>